Charlie today on the five basic commands and he's been working just a little bit on sit. Other than that, he knows nothing. So I'm going to work first on what I call the attention command or eyes. And I have a small piece of chicken here. Charlie, eyes. Good boy. So you just I put the chicken in front of his nose so that he would smell it. There you go. And then once he's focused on that, you move it and put it up to your nose so that he looks you in the eye. Eyes. Good boy. Charlie? Eyes. Good boy. And with consistency, he'll learn to do it even when you don't have a treat. Charlie? Eyes. Good boy. There you go. The next command we're going to work on will be come. Charlie, come here. Come. Come here. Come here. Come here, Charlie. Good boy. Come here. Come. See, I'm just gently pulling on the leash. Only just enough to put some pressure on so he feels uncomfortable. Come on, Charlie. I'm not dragging him to me. I could, but good boy, Charlie. Come. Come on. Come. Good boy, Charlie. Good puppy. Yes, that's right. Good boy. Yes, good boy. Now we'll try again. Charlie, come. Come here. Come on. Come here, Charlie. Come. Remember? Come. Oh, yes, you got you. Come. This is not good. Oh, he's looking away. Come. Come on. We want him to come to me. Good boy. That's how you do it. There's a good puppy. You want more? Charlie, come! Good boy. I didn't have to put any pressure on that time. There you go. Oh, yeah. You know I have more now. Charlie, come! Come! Good puppy. Good boy. Come! Good boy. sit command. So, with the puppy standing, gently pull up on the leash and say, sit. Good boy. Good boy, child. You can also teach this off the leash, which is how I usually do it. I usually teach this off the leash it's by getting his attention. Charlie! Charlie! Good. Of course, he sits a little too quick. Charlie, sit. Put your hand under his front and gently push him back into a sitting position. Good boy. And then immediately reward him. Come on. Good boy. Sit. You can also teach it by simply holding the treat above his nose and he'll naturally go into a sitting position to get it. Good boy. And as always, remember to keep the lessons upbeat and short. Many short lessons are much, much better than one long one. Go learn a lot more. Definitely. This is Tim. Since I forgot to take a video of training, teaching the sit, sit, 
stay command while I had Charlie. I decided I'd show it with Cap, even though he already knows it. So, sit up. With your dog in a sitting position, or a down position, but I usually use the sitting position. Get us to Cap. Get his attention, focused completely on you, and then say firmly and clearly, stay. And then back away, showing with body motion that you want him to stay. Stay. Back up. Back up. Now, sit. If he gets up and comes to you, back him into the original spot where you had him and tell him again. Yep. Stay. Nope, nope, nope. Sit up. Sit up. Stay. Good boy, Cap. Good boy. Now, if he jumps up and starts running towards you when you start praising him, stop praising. And just tell him to sit and stay again. Uh, 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 sit up. Come on, sit up. Stay. Eventually, you should be able to walk completely out of sight without him getting worried. Good boy, cat. Good boy. Good boy, cat. Yes. Another interest or another command you can build off stay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sit up. So you can add a little more pressure to it. Now show him the treat. Stay. Down. Stay. And drop it. It's about two feet away from him. Stay, cat. You want it? You want it? And that is how you teach the command stay. Now, the down command is probably the most difficult to teach, at least to a very young puppy. But I'm going to work on it today with Charlie. So, I'm going to place him with his back against the stump so he can't back up. Charlie, sit. Good boy. Put him in a sitting position. Then take your treat. And put it in your hand like this. See, I have my hand up. Then cover it with your thumb. Charlie, down. Good boy. See, his shoulders went down a little bit. That's what you're looking for. See, he knows I have a treat. He's looking for more. Charlie, down. Down. Come on, down. No. Down. No. Down. Down. There you go. Sometimes they'll just lay down and trying to get the treat by following it. Sometimes they need a little help. Alright, you want it? Sure. Down. Down. Come on. Down. Good boy, Charlie. Good boy. That's right. Good boy. When he gets it, make sure to praise him very thoroughly. Sit up, Charlie. Come on. Sit up. Alright. Do it again. Down. Down, Charlie. Come on. Down. Yeah, you want that? Oh, wow. Yum. Down. Come on. It can be helpful to just lay him down. You want it? Sit up. Sit. Come on. Sit. Sit, Charlie. Come on. Sit. Good boy. Keep him interested. 
You know, puppies have a very short attention span, which is why short lessons are better than long ones. Down, Charlie. Down. Come on. Good boy. Good boy, Charlie. And he, they likely won't get it the first time. But if you keep trying, we'll figure out what you mean. The key is just consistency and doing it a lot. Yeah, good boy, Charlie.